Okay, you know you have a problem when this is just part of your car keys. I guess the disease has affected me. In any case, I wanted to share a brief update on something that I received in the mail from the author of this book, Rob Kyle. For those of you who haven't seen, I did a feature on Art Fitzpatrick and Van Kaufman's advertisements that they did for Pontiac here, the 68 GTO, but it was a duo that one of them did the cars, one did the people in the background, and they were just fabulous illustrations. And this is a 200 page book that Rob was gracious enough to send to me. And I don't normally do paid endorsements, and, but I did get a free book in exchange for plugging it. And I'm plugging it because it's, um, if you love automotive art, this is a coffee table book that you absolutely want to have in your collection. It has all the pictures from Buick and even Opal in here. I mean, Pontiac. Beautiful, beautifully done book. Talks about the history of Art Fitzpatrick and Van Kaufman. If you're an automotive historian, you want to order this book. I'll put a link in the... Uh, in the comments section for you to take a look. And again, Rob was thankful, I'm very thankful to him for autographing this, but super pleased with it. I've already shared it with a number of my friends um, and they've ordered copies. So take a look at it. And right now it continues to be cold here in the Midwest. So just checking on various vehicles in the fleet, seeing how they're doing. So far, all the batteries are holding up. These old cars, the, uh, they uh, don't tend to have the battery strain all that much, but you do wanna make sure that you don't have any current drains on them. And if you don't, then you shouldn't have really any issues. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe or email me at rareclassiccars at yahoo.com. And be sure to check out Rob Kyle's book at www.fitzandvan.com, F-I-T-Z-A-N-D-V-A-N.com. You can order a copy from there directly. Thanks for watching.